an effort tonight? Uh, yeah, we wanted a real workman game, good, solid road game. I thought, uh, for the most part, a couple soft spots, but other than that, we were, we were pretty solid all the way through. I uh, thought we had a lot of chances. That makes you a little nervous. We had a lot of chances we could have pushed the lead out a little bit and uh, and didn't capitalize, and so it stayed close, but uh, but I thought we did enough good things to win tonight. Nice to see some McDavid magic up close again. Uh, yeah, he's, he makes a difference out there, obviously, and it's... Uh, you know, when you add a player like that to your lineup, it just it just changes what he brings, but also what other people around him bring. So it's uh, it was good to have him back. He makes the whole the whole team seems to play better somehow. It's not just him. How is that? Well, well, top players make other players around them better, and sometimes it's the players that they're playing with. Sometimes it's just the aura of being a good team, and you play confident when you have good players. And so that's. Uh, that's what he brings. I mean, he just he has that uh, when he when he gets out there and is really dug in and playing, he's he's an impact on the game and and uh, what he brings, but also drags a lot of other people with him. Mike Green added to the mix. Yeah. Just your thoughts on, on bringing a veteran D man. <laughs> Good veteran puck moving D who uh, gives us some depth on the on the back end now and uh, one of the areas we were looking at and Kenny was able to. Get something done, so we're we're very happy about uh, adding them adding to our group. A couple guys in the room were just saying, this time of the year, you always want to be in a position to add, and I wonder just what that does, you know, for the psyche or mentality of the team regarding, the, you know, the coach, the GM, everyone believes in us moving forward. Well, it's way better to add. I said that the other day. Way better to add than then subtract, and your whole team is a little more at ease with it. And uh, you know, I, I look at those players in that room. They they've earned the right to uh, to keep pushing here and. Uh, Kenny's added a piece for us which, uh, that will help, but uh, I give the credit all to the players. They're the ones that have to come out and get the job done, and, and they want to be a good team. They want to be a playoff team. They want to earn the right to be a playoff team. So uh, to put ourselves in this position where we're looking to try to get better down the stretch, that's, uh, that's a positive sign for us. Is there any notable change in the timeline of either Russell or Clackbaum at this point? Uh, no, no, that so didn't. They're didn't no, they're, yeah, the they're, they're both, both right on the same. Uh, Russell is still, um, the, the timeline on him is kind of murky. He's still skating at home, but it's a little bit murky. Clef is, uh, he'll be right on, on the timeline we expect, so so uh, be good to get him back. Yeah, we'll see how, we'll, we'll see how the mix comes out. Yeah, we'll, we'll see how the mix comes out. We just, we have depth. You've had some young puck moving defensemen take steps when you've had these injuries. Once you get Green in and people get healthy, will this be the best passing defense you've coached in Edmonton? Well, we got to see once we'll, we'll get him up and going here. I do like like Jonesy had a real strong game tonight for us. I mean, he's he's really taken some steps forward. Was good. Bearsy has just been he's been a really good player all year long. So they're both uh, young defensemen, but they move the puck very well and they. You know, they speed up your game when you can move the puck quick and, and you've got some forwards that want it in their hands quick, it speeds up your game. So it's good to see.